Friday night. What do you say, you and me? Uh, sorry, I already have a date. So break it. No. Why not? Who's it with? Chuck Wilson. What? You heard me. Nice thing to tell me before I take a history file. What was I supposed to do? He asked me. Of course he did. You know, Steve, you are not the center of everybody's universe. What makes you think that Chucky was thinking of you when he asked me to the dance? Because I know him better than you do. And he doesn't care about you. Why is it that every time some guy likes me, you try to ruin it? To me, Chuck Wilson isn't just any guy. Steve, we're about to take a final here. If I flunk history, you can thank Chucky Wilson for me. What? You're losing it, man. I mean it. It's all because of him. Wait a minute, Steve. You don't even talk to Chuck Wilson. What is he to you? You don't know who he is, do you? You don't watch nearly enough TV. <laughs> Whoa, cowboy! Whoa! <laughs> Crash! Chuck Wilson was the little kid on your mom's TV show? Mm-hmm. He's as obnoxious now as he was then. He's got himself thrown out at practically every private school in Los Angeles. Chucky, what are you doing? Hi, Mom. But that's your daddy's birthday cake. I was just testing it to make sure it was good. Oh. <laughs> I think I'm gonna be sick. Ah, come on. He was just some stupid little kid. Not to me. When I was little, I used to go to the studio to see my mom. They'd stick us together because, you know, we're the same age. He'd hit me, bite me, pull my hair, break my toys, and every time, I'd be the one who'd get blamed. Why? Because he's a star, Brandon. A little five-year-old with an attitude, and if he didn't get his way, he wouldn't go on. A lot of millions rode on that cute smile of his, so no one much cared if little Steve-O was crying. Well, what about your mom? She played along. It was all part of the job. Know your lines, be nice to Chucky. Oh, come on, it was 10 or 12 years ago. You were just little kids. He could have changed. You know what he said when I first saw him at West Beverly? Watch out, Steve-O. Chucky's back. You know, like the movie? He was kidding. You're just letting him get to you, that's all. I thought he was out of my life. First thing I see him at West Beverly, and you're not going to believe this. What? They're talking about doing a big Hartley House reunion show. Hi. Steve, you didn't tell me we had company. Brandon's not company. So, Mrs. Sanders, Steve tells me you're going to be doing a Hartley House reunion. Congratulations. Don't jinx it. We haven't signed the deal yet. But Norman says it looks good. We may even get a TV movie. If Charles agrees to it. Charles? Little Chucky? Whatever you do, gorgeous, do not call him that at dinner tonight. On second thought, I think I'll eat at Brandon's. Funny. I know you two have had your differences, but this really means a lot to me. <laughs>